Disclaimer, this video is not for anybody under the age of 21. The content in this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only, and is strictly my opinion. Thank you, and enjoy the video. What it do, what it do, everybody. It is your boy, Matt, from Disorder Vapes, coming back with another disposable vape review. Today, we got the Mr. Fog Switch in the building. Got it in a couple different flavors. We got Bubble Gang Watermelon Ice, and we got Lemon Rainbow Ice, all right? So, super excited to try out these flavors. You know what the deal is. I'm gonna run through the specifications and then we will dive into it, all right? So um, these claim 5,500 puffs out of these. We got 15 milliliters of juice, so quite a lot. Um, comes with a 650 milliamp battery that is rechargeable with a Type-C port. The ones that I have here are 5% synthetic nicotine, all right? So um, before we actually try out these new flavors, I have been vaping on this blue raspberry cherry ice um, for the past uh, four days until um, this morning. The battery finally died, and then I was charging it for about an hour. Then it's all good to go. Um, that being said, I wouldn't charge these for too long. Otherwise, they kind of develop a funky aftertaste. So um, I'd probably leave it on there about 40 minutes. That might be just about the sweet spot. Um, but without further ado, let's try out these new flavors. Let's try the Lemon Rainbow Ice. All right, so take it out of the package. Ooh, they actually come with a Type-C cable um, already included in the box. So that is super convenient. Just toss that to the side for now. And comes in package like this. And let's rip it out, man. Let's try this. All right, so the Mr. Fog switch. As you can tell, there is a switch in the middle here. Um, so that's actually gonna be a switch for the airflow adjustment. It doesn't like change flavor. So I just wanna clarify that. Doesn't switch flavors, it switches airflow, all right? Um, so here we go. We got the, on the front here, just says the flavor, Mr. Fog switch. I really like how the uh, charging port is on the side of it instead of the bottom. Um, but on the bottom, there's a little bit of a sticker. Really nothing there uh, besides the light. The light will turn on when you plug it in to charge it. And then when it's done charging, uh, the light will turn off. That being said, like I said, uh, just leave it on th there for about 40 minutes and you should be good. Um, but let me see if we can, you can see the hole there uh, with the adjustments kind of like halfway open, um, but you know, just turn it up to close it off completely and then turn it down if you want that airflow all the way open. Okay, so this one is a black and white colorway. Also, the mouthpiece is kind of like silicone, so it's kind of chewy, kind of chew on it, feel me? Um, but uh, yeah, let's just dive into this. What is this? Rainbow, what was this? Lemon rainbow ice? Cheers, everybody, let's get it. Yeah, <laughs> flavor on here is nice. I'll dive into that uh, blue raspberry cherry ice uh, later on in the video, but let me actually close the airflow off a little bit. I actually like it with just the hole slightly open, like a little bit of a tighter draw. That was like all the way open. So I tend to get a little bit better flavor if the uh, airflow is like, you know, turned down a little bit tighter draw. Mmm, yeah, the rainbow on here is perfect. Um, just kind of like a, mm, just a candy-like rainbow flavor. Uh, kind of, I don't know, just mixed candies, I would say. Um, it's kind of hard to explain. It's kind of like the unicorn flavor um, of e-juice. But the lemon on there, it's it's ever so slight, but you can tell that it's like a little bit tangy. Um, it's kind of like a sweet and sour. Uh, the ice on it, not super overpowering, just kind of enhances the flavor, I would say. But really uh, a job well done on the Lembo, Lemon Rainbow Ice. Yeah, I like that. Okay, let's move on. 
to the bubble gang watermelon ice i wonder why um it's not bubble gum watermelon ice but you know that is what it is we will find out all right so uh here we go let me take this off um yeah man watermelon gangbang cheers let's go Ooh, yeah. Ooh, I like that one a lot. Okay. Ooh. These are pretty strong as well. You're definitely going to get a buzz if you hit these like back to back. The ice on this one t uh, actually tends to be a little bit more pronounced. I would say it's a little bit more cooling on this watermelon uh, bubble gang. Um, but uh, yeah, man very very sweet the bubble gum i would say definitely is more dominant on this one and then the watermelon is you get that on the exhale kind of leaves a taste on your tongue very very sweet very sugary kind of cheek tingling sweetness on these vapes um but man i like these a lot not gonna lie this is about halfway airflow the uh, airflow adjustment works perfectly, I do got to say. Um, yeah, no complaints there whatsoever. It actually has a purpose. It does its job. Plus, it's, it's just kind of cool. I noticed with the one I've been vaping for about four days now, um, you know, I just can't help but to fiddle with this little switch. I just all the time, I'm just kind of, you know, pressing and turning it around. So it kind of works as like a... It's like a fidget spinner or something. Uh, <laughs> or like, I don't know. It's kind of like a squish ball to, I don't know, just take your uh, mind off of things. But really, really like these. I would actually say in terms of sweetness, um, the blue raspberry cherry ice um, actually might be the sweetest out of all three of these that I've tried, even though I've been vaping on this one for about four days. Very, very nice. Um, so that's about all I got to say. If you guys got any questions, leave them down below. Um, like I said, though, if you're going to, uh, you know, charge these, I would just keep an eye on it. Don't like overcharge it because you don't want to like burn anything. Um, you don't want any burn, burnt taste, do we? Um, but uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe if you love vape related content. And I will catch you guys next time. I'm out here. Peace.